We're hanging out at Saskatoon Salsa Dance Company. Right now, I'm joined by City Councillor Troy Davies and Kimberly Perrant. Did I do that one okay? Yes. Okay, perfect. Just wanted to make sure I said that right. Now, these two are the winners from last year's Swinging with the Stars. Ah, a big high five to both of you. Congratulations, that's so exciting. Of course, we're here today celebrating the upcoming Swinging with the Stars 2015. Now, Troy, let's talk a little bit about what was it like winning the trophy last year? I see you brought the trophy here. I keep it uh, close to me every night, actually. When we go to bed at night, it, it keeps me warm. People <laughs> tend to know me now. They like me. So it's, you know, it was, uh, you know what, the whole experience was, was amazing. You know, and we've, I've been a part of a lot of charity events and Absolutely. planning them and being a part of them and, and participating in them. But mm -hmm. this was something that was completely outside the box to me uh, yes. whatsoever. And then my whole respect for the dance world is, is <laughs> upside down now because it I is bet. not easy. But uh, you feed off the crowd, and it sounds like uh, we're going to have another amazing crowd close to a sellout again if it's not already sold out, so it'd be fun. Yes, absolutely. And Troy was the celebrity uh, for last year being the city councillor. So what's it like being honoured by being asked to be a part of the competition? Well, I'd, I'll be the first, and I know everyone else will agree we don't really see ourselves as celebrities. Yeah. Just people are willing to have some fun and, and yeah. just get our friends out to enjoy really dance. And, yeah. and the biggest thing is we raise a lot of money for, mm -hmm. for charity, and that's... And, and it's doing it in a fun way. It is. Tons of fun. That's the perfect word to describe Swinging with the Stars. Now, Kimberly, let's talk a little bit about Give Me the 411. How was Troy as a dancer? <laughs> Troy was incredible, actually. He's a super hard worker. Um, we had so many laughs. Like, we just, we pretty much spent half of every practice killing ourselves laughing. But yeah, it, it, he was great. And Kimberly is the owner of Saskatoon Salsa Dance Company, and you've been dancing probably all your life. So, why do you have such a passion for salsa? Uh, I just really connect with the music. I, I love the music, I love Cuban culture, mm. and yeah, that's, I, I just feel, yeah, I just know. feel it. Just <laughs> makes you want to shake, and we're, yeah. we're actually going to be shaking it later, yeah. so you definitely don't want to go anywhere, and you want to watch that, because I really don't know how it's going to go. Now, <laughs> Troy, before we wrap up, describe the atmosphere. What can people expect the atmosphere to be like at this year's Swinging with the Stars? Well, first of all, I'm not a great dancer. Kim's being nice, <laughs> but uh, I try hard. But, oh. you know, the biggest thing, uh, that it, just the, the fun factor. Yeah. And I, you have to walk in the room expecting that you're going to have a great time. Mm -hmm. And that's usually what, I, what everyone else told me that they just come in they had signs made up for the dancers Aww. they had people cheering it was we had a really yeah. good group of people and I looked at the the celebs this year and yes. like it's uh, there's some great people there so it's you know come on out and have some fun and for a great charity as well which I know Brett will talk more about absolutely it's all for a great cause all right like I mentioned earlier if you don't want to miss Kimberly and I doing some shaking some salsa maybe I can even win a trophy or two for myself uh, make sure you keep watching today's Go Saskatoon